So water damage to Scucko um, happens often here. And the, I think the biggest culprit is flat paint. And most of the homes here were painted with flat paint. And if it was satin paint and it's left long enough and it starts to fade, it actually becomes flat. So flat paint always allows moisture to transfer through it. And we really don't want water inside the wall whether this is on your home or this garden wall retaining wall, it doesn't matter. We just don't want water inside your wall. So it gets to the wood and causes swelling, causes freezing and thawing and cracking. So here's my analogy. If, if you put water on that surface and it gets darker, water's getting in there. And once that water's in there, once its surface is wet, and if it continues raining on it, it actually wicks it right in the surface, so it's no longer shedding off the surface. So, uh, you know, we get a little sprinkle in the spring or summer, it's no big deal, it cooks right back out. But the problem is, when we get to December, January, February, March, or April, and we get an afternoon rain, and that water gets on there, and it just keeps driving rain on there, and you know that's what our winters are like, we get driving rain, so that water's on there, and it starts wicking in deep into the wall, and then the temperature drops. So, you know, if it rains at four o'clock, it might be 55 degrees, but nighttime it could be 25 degrees or 20 or 15. Now you got all that water that's inside that wall that didn't evaporate out, and now it starts freezing and thawing. And this is what causes the majority of our cracks. Now, worst case scenario, then it starts blowing the stucco off, and then you got bigger problems. So, always gonna recommend that we go with at least a satin finish because it's gonna initially shed the water, and as long as it's got its sheen on there, it's shedding water, not getting into the wall. If you've got your south-facing wall, your west-facing wall, and it's long enough, old enough, seven, eight years, maybe 10 years, and it started to go flat, it's time to paint those walls so water doesn't get in there. So you can see this is, uh, this is a nice sunny day. I think it's probably about 72 degrees, blue sky, nice breeze. This is already drying out. It's not a problem in spring or summer. It's a problem when we get those afternoon rains when the temperature is going to drop below freezing. So um, if you were in California, not a problem. It gets in there, it dries back out. If you're in southern, mid-California, it doesn't get that freezing temperature. Flat paint down in the Phoenix area, down in the valley, works all day long, every day, because they never get that freezing and thawing. They get all the rain that they get. It just cooks back out just like this has and disappeared in these few short minutes. Here we're worried about that dropping temperature after the afternoon rains.